We talked a little bit about residue management and cover crop management. And one question we get a lot is about termination timing is cover, will cover crops use soil moisture? Well, yes, they use soil moisture, but what we found is um, that soil moisture is quickly recharged um, if you get a rain between termination and the planting of your cotton. Now, talk a little bit about two different termination timings. I like the um, wheat, this is the cover crop we're using in these plots, to go a little bit longer and mature out, at least get to a heading stage, 50% heading or so. And you usually see lasting residue if you can get a stalk that will last about 18 months. Now this year on these plots, we had to terminate a little bit earlier to, to, due to a drift issue. So that was in mid-March versus toward the end of the April when we normally do it. And that residue was in a vegetative stage, and this is the residue we're left with, and this is from this is from March. So that degrades very rapidly. So a lot of the residue we see here is actually from the previous year, from um, April of 2016 versus uh, March of 2017. So if you want lasting residue, I would encourage you to delay irrigation timing or termination timing of your cover crops. Your soil moisture will be replenished, especially if it's on irrigated cotton. Um, you shouldn't be concerned about your soil moisture and it will pay off in the long term to build up your organic matter in your system.